A ruck is defined as two opponents in physical contact over the ball on the ground. Open play ends and an offside line for each team now extends across the field. Players entering the ruck must join onside. A jackal player on their feet who has hands on the ball immediately after a tackle and before the ruck forms is allowed to keep contesting for the ball even as the ruck forms around them. As soon as a ruck is formed, no other players can use their hands to win the ball. A jackal player only has one shot at winning the ball by hand. If that player is driven off the ball by the opposition, then the opportunity to play the ball by hands has ceased. Having a second attempt to play the ball by hand or playing the ball while off feet is illegal. Players joining a ruck must bind onto a player in the ruck from behind the last feet of their teammates in the ruck. A bind requires use of the whole arm from hand to shoulder. A player cannot charge into a ruck and simply hit a player with their shoulder. A player cannot play opposition players who are not part of the ruck. This is illegal. All players who enter the ruck must attempt to stay on their feet. The scrum half or player clearing the ball must be allowed to dig the ball out from amongst bodies and cannot be touched by an opposition player in the ruck until the ball is completely clear of bodies and out of the ruck. The ruck ends when the ball is out and completely clear of the ruck. A maul forms when a player carrying the ball is held up by one or more opponents and one or more of the ball carrier's teammates bind on the ball carrier. Once again, open play ends and an offside line for each team now extends across the field. The laws for entering the maul are almost identical to those for entering the ruck. Players joining a maul must do so from behind or alongside the foot of their hindmost teammate in the maul and must bind when joining. Entering the maul from in front of the last feet is illegal and may be penalised. A player or players must not intentionally try to collapse the maul. This is dangerous and should be penalised.